What is it? What is it? I give it to you. Not. It's not. I give it to you. I found it. It's here. Mama, this diary. So today you are going to know more about Mama Best, especially the new members who are just going to know me today. So who is this Mama Best who is standing in front of you and why I have been called Mama Best? So let me take on a journey, a quick journey in Porto Sal to six minutes about myself. Going back, childhood, my name, when I am opening with us, in the first few pages, my name, my identity. By the way, I love my, I love my name. My name is Freya. Do you know what it's meaning? Some people will say, the satellite, the phone, the Freya. No. Others will say, light. No. It's more than that. I am a cluster of stars. That's why I like to say the meaning of my name to everyone. But when we were kids, one of the most difficult letters to pronounce in Arabic was that. So what my sibling will call me or my neighbors? Furaya. Or Suraya. So I, while I was growing, I thought my name is Suraya actually, which is very close <laughs> to Furaya. Just see him instead of that. But it was OK. Then, moving, growing up with my sibling, Arabic family, all Arabic family. I will not tell you how many kids we were at that home. But let me say, I am in the middle. We have engineers now, as a grown up, we have a civil engineer, and you can count. We have civil engineer, chemical engineer, mechanical engineer, we have management, we have accounting, we have physics, we have. <laughs> Man, and we have a lawyer, and we have IT as well. So I know now you, you calculated all of them. <laughs> then school, the enjoyment, and going from elementary to intermediate to secondary, especially in secondary school, what was of my village, knowing wider people that opened the horizon and choosing math as one of my favorite subjects and to be my favorite, to be the favorite students to my teacher. Moving to the university. If you know me, I love nature and animals. So what do you think fit to me? Biology. So I chose biology. And it's not like now when you, or when you, apply to university, you have to write 10 choices, and then you get the last one. No, I wrote biology, and I got it. Was it fun? It was fun? No, it was miserable. If you try, just to try biology 101, and you will know my feeling. You have to memorize this long word about plants anatomy, animals anatomy, I don't know what, and we have not only to write them, we have to write them, and we have to pronounce them. And imagine coming back from, coming from government school. My English at that time, same as all Bahrainis. We're good. <laughs> we get a new way. So I realized that I am not a biology person. And luckily, I changed directly to something which I like which is solving equations and playing with numbers, and that was math, which I finished and got a degree in it. But don't ask me to do calculations after work, especially calculating bills when we are having dinners at any restaurant that have a cup of tea. Moving to Toastmasters, so how I get involved in Toastmasters? Mm. That was in 2009. Someone invited me to a club. And if you know Mama best, she never say no to <laughs> any invitation or any offer. So I said, yes, OK. And I went happily to the club. And guess what? It was a general meeting. And for the new member, general meetings means no guest is allowed. 
And at that time, I was still having my car. My brother dropped me, so I had to wait outside till they finished their discussion, the club discussions. Then they allowed me to enter. And I entered. I didn't know what was going on. Thirty-five eyes were staring at me. I introduced myself, said they, were, they continued their discussions. A lot of clapping. That was OK. But then I joined the club. My mentor was the same person who invited me. After that, I didn't see him. They asked me to deliver the icebreaker. And I did, happily. They asked me to deliver it, but in front of the audience. But I preferred at that time to hide behind the lectern. I will not say like any others who say that we were behind the lectern. I want our knees wide shaking. It wasn't shaking, but for me it was strange because I was in front, not my students. I am in front of people, some older than me, some same my age, some younger than me. All of them staring at me and I have to share my story to them. But the journey continued. I became club president, area director, division director. And through this journey, it was ups and downs, but I enjoyed my journey. And as Mr. President said, diary for our broken life, we write it. Just write everything in it, even the trouble you face. Just enjoy and learn from it. Back to you.